North College Hill police are investigating a single vehicle crash near Galbraith Road. They tell us a Duke Energy pole was also hit, leaving hundreds without power. Our Taylor Davis joins us live from the scene. Taylor, uh, what are police saying? Also, can you show us some of the aftermath of what this looks like? Well, as you can see behind me, this is a very, very active scene. You can see where the caution tape is blocking off where this utility pole is tipping over in front of this home. Now, we learned from North College Hill Police that a single car crashed into this pole. Now, that car has been towed away, but the, they do suspect that the driver was impaired. Now, the driver did suffer minor injuries, but the lights are expected to be out a while here in this area. Now, this is here at the intersection of West Galbraith and Clover Nook. And if you come down this way, you'll start to see those road closure signs. Now, if you're taking a look at this uh, map, about 500 people are without power at this time. And we're learning that this could be for 12 to 16 hours that people will be without lights here in this area but uh, they're here at the scene and they're continuing to do work to get those lights back on for the residents who live in this area taylor davis fox 19 now thank you taylor and breaking now two people are in the hospital after a shooting and